Quick review, Kendall Conrad, Mayfair Festival of the Arts 2024. Now, I've caught Ken, I've experienced Kendall's over the past several years, a few times. Uh, like, I think it was Mayfair last year, I think. But um, one thing, Kendall somehow, her performance th today, I mean, this was like Memorial Day weekend here in Lear Valley and I'm sure in no other areas, it was like the perfect weather. People don't like the heat. Yeah, right. It was hot, sunny out for the most part. Friday, uh, Mayfair kicks off Friday evening, Saturday, and today's Sunday. And Mayfair is kind of like, even though they call Allentown a city, which realistically is a small town, um, Mayfair is a small festival, which is now in its third incarnation here at Cedar Crest College. Perfect uh, place for it. But somehow, Kendall not only managed to capture, but to really like emphasize her, through her performance, the true feel of Mayfair, the weekend and the holiday. She, you know, not only through her singing and guitar playing, but also, you know, just the way she, she was on stage, it was like very relaxed, very, um, okay, you're, you know, you felt, she became part of the festival, not just, I was just sitting there watching her. <coughs> you felt like she was a true, you know, a part of the festival. I know it sounds like really vague and everything. It's very hard to describe the feel of it, of her performance, but she managed to, you know, I mean, you know, I heard, last time I was here, yesterday I was here, I heard Lee Greenwood got Bless the USA twi twice. Great song, love it, you know, love what it's about. But I missed her first couple songs, but she didn't do she didn't do that instead. She went with Martina McBride Independence Day, which was very which was a very cool. I love you know it's a song you rarely hear in any performance, um, you know any cover song current cover songs, especially country, even country. But just like I said, it was just like great to truly experience her, and if, you know, and just like okay. This is what, in her performance, really kind of like, you, you know, like what you see in the movies with the small town summer festivals. Um, maybe you grew up in a small town that had, you know, this really cool festival for the summer holidays or whatever. And one thing I really I want to emphasize here about, about Kendall is when you experience a show, she, well, number one, thankfully, she actually, she actually did a lot of originals, which covers are great but going but being here in Lehigh Valley went like, way too long um and doing a lot of music reviews in my first media I'm just tired of the cover bands so Kendall Kendall went and chose she, she actually did a lot of originals and her originals were fantastic but one thing I really want to emphasize about her when you experience the performances expect incredible an incredible level and an incredible level of balance between not only the, the power of her guitar playing, but the power of her vocals. It's like one emphasizes and feeds off the other, which is something you really don't experience all that much anymore. Um, she's a true singer-songwriter, and a true she is a performer in the truest sense of the word. Like I said, here, it was just like, she, she just kind of like was up on stage like, you know what? I don't want you to watch this, to watch the show. I want you to feel like you're a part of it, and I want to feel like I'm a part of, like I'm a part of this festival. Not just hey, you're in the crowd. I'm up here singing. I'm up here singing, playing guitar. That's the end of it. Like you see, unfortunately, you experience it with a lot of bands and singer-songwriters. Kendall really, really knows how to make you, you know. Make you make you catch you off guard, like with me, you know. I was I was going to go to New York today. Body hit the physical women last night. It's like, all right, just do a third day at Mayfair. I saw she was going to be there. Okay, maybe do a quick live music review. But she really caught me off guard. Where it was like she helped me get the true feeling and the true experience of what Mayfair this holiday weekend, the beautiful weather, and Memorial Day were really about. Kendall Conrad is a very, very, very rare performer. You really have to experience one of her shows. Michael Phoenix, Founder Staff, Fire City Illusion. 
standing outside of Cedar Crest College because you can't smoke on campus. Obvious reasons, but still, when you have to walk out, walk anyway. Um, Allentown, PA, wishing you, your family, and friends, as always, and I'm very sincere and serious every time I say this. Only the best and much success in your lives. Stay safe, everyone. Have a wonderful summer.